Hi, I'm Henry from Shorter Credit UK, and today we're going to talk about the O'Neill Mutant 5.4 Winter Wetsuit uh, for 2014-2015, so for this winter. Uh, the Mutant is a firm favourite, um, it's one of those suits that really does sort of sell itself, it's at a very good price um, and it's also very warm. So just to talk you through some of the features of it first, obviously the biggest feature of the Mutant is the closure system. Pretty much you much unique to this suit um, and yeah no one else really does anything like it so the mutant the great thing about it is it comes with a hood attachment so for the coldest days and also a neck so when it's a bit warmer or you don't want to wear a hood you can just swap it out for the neck really simple system two zips one at the one at the back here one at the front unzip it zip on the other option and away you go pretty much um, I would suggest doing it before you put the suit on because when you've got the suit on it proves very difficult and you need some help but Really nice there, so you almost get two suits in one um, in terms of warmth there um, and you know just the hood that's always going to fit well and creates a really good seal so no water's going to get in um, and you'll be away. So yeah, that's the Mutant closure system. Uh, it does work really well, again, we've improved and time and time again just on how many suits we've sold um, from O'Neill. But yeah, really nice little system, nice tabs for the zip, etc. Um, really does keep, keep, keep you warm and gives you those two options, which is nice. So the suit is, as I said, 5'4", and made from ultra stretch neoprene. So that's sort of the, the second tier of neoprene now, um, only to be replaced by the Techno Butter, which comes higher up in the range to the Pyro Freak and Pyrotech and Psycho Freak. Um, the suit is still very, very flexible. I mean, this is the 5'4 I'm holding here, and you still get loads and loads of flex from it. Um, it's just slightly doesn't dry as quick and um, perhaps isn't as light in terms of overall weight of the suit compared to the Techno Butter material. Still got the single lined in the front here, so single line material all the way through the front panel and the back. Really again keeps you nice and warm, um, keeps that wind off so good for kiting, windsurfing and surfing at the same time. Um, just allows any water that does sit on here to get whipped away straight away instead of cooling you down. Uh, goes all the way through the body, 100% uh, ultra stretch neoprene, so you know, nice and flexible still, uh, but a warm suit at the same time because it is that 5-4 all the way through. St the seam technology they use is the single fluid seam weld, so the same as the Pyrotech. Um, it's basically the idea behind it is they glue and blind stitch the suit, so they put the two pieces of neoprene together, glue and blind stitch, which is where the needle goes halfway through, and they glue one side, and then they add the extra layer of fluid seam weld to the suit, which you can see going all the way around, uh, around the panelling. Um, just really allows the suit to be nice and watertight and keep you, keep you warmer for longer, basically. Um, some nice little new touches they've done for this winter. It's just on the cuffs here, they've added a bit of a, a sort of base wetsuit glue, neoprene glue, um, just on the top here and on the bottom. The idea behind this is to create a slightly tighter cuff. Um, so what they were finding from, from feedback from riders is that the, the cuff was getting a bit loose over time. Um, so they've added a bit of glue here just to tighten it up around there. Um, I wouldn't say it's too tight by any means, but it still just ensures that less water has the opportunity to get up through those sort of entry points. Um, and yeah, and also makes it look quite cool as well, just a nice little graphic change there on the suit. Uh, the suit comes with the firewall on the inside, so right on the inside there on the chest panel, uh, you have the red material. This is uh, the Ultraflex firewall, basically allows the water to drain straight through, so it dries quite quickly, but also keeps you nice and warm. So um, similar to sort of the flash dry linings or the all dry linings you see in some of the suits, that O'Neill just put it in this section here. Um, not designed to be super fast dry, but designed to be super warm. So really, again, the, the thing behind the Mutant is warmth. Um, you know, it's maybe not as flexible as some of the other suits, but really is warmth. If you're looking for more flexible, maybe look at a Pyrotech, but for potentially a little bit more warmth, the Mutant probably is going to offer that, especially with the sort of the built-in hood and the two options for the neck um, to swap it over if you need to. Uh, obviously comes in a men's suit called the Mutant, a ladies' version called the Deluxe. Um, and they also do it in kids, so kids is exactly the same specification as is the ladies, um, just slightly different colours, so again, comes with the hood and the neck as well, so you really do get the two options there. So good for a kid if he's going to be, if you don't know if they're going to be going in, in the coldest month, uh, months really going to offer that sort of multiple options for it and comes in some quite cool colours as well. So the Mutant 5.4, not a huge amount of changes from last season, um, just a few more nice little touches to it, um, and again, really designed to be a warm, medium price point suit um, for this winter. One of our best sellers every year, we do really well on it, people seem to really get behind it and buy a Mutant you know, every couple of years just because they know the sort of quality they're going to be getting from O'Neill, 
Um, but yeah, really good sort of medium price point suit. I'd say if you're looking for a bit more flexibility, look at a Pyrotech um, in the chest zip anyway. Uh, if you're, if this is maybe a bit over budget, maybe look at a Hyper Freak. So that's the Techno Butter, but without the fluid seam weld um, and without the, the material in the chest. It's not going to be as warm, but obviously it's a slightly less in price point. Um, but yeah, really good quality suit. I mean, it's an O'Neill staple that people love. I'm sure you can read reviews online of it. Um, it does work really well. So yeah, that's the O'Neill Mutant 5.4 for 2014-2015, available now at Shaw.